to my channel. Hope you're all okay. If you haven't already, please subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. So today, um, I'm gonna go check out Aldi. Um, I've heard they've done like a Veganuary event, started on Sunday. Um, I've seen a few Instagram posts of a few things people have found, so I thought I'd go and check it out, and of course bring you guys along, and then I'll show you once I get home everything that I've brought. So yeah, hope you enjoy. Not sure how much I'm gonna exactly be able to film in here, depends how busy it is. Um, so I'll try and film what I can, but if not, I'll show you all guys when I get home anyway, so don't worry. It was quite loud in Ali, so I just got a few video shots for you, so here's a few of the different um, aisles and sections they had of vegan things. I'm back with another bag for life absolutely rammed full of vegan food didn't intend to buy this much didn't go in for this much I just kind of got a bit carried away and sucked into the amount of choice that there was so I actually ended up spending £42.52 honestly I was thinking on the way home Costa was a success Audi was a success. We're on the 4th of January and I feel slightly worried that I could have peaked too soon, you know. Could it all go downhill from here? Could I try Starbucks next and they haven't actually got anything? Will I try Greg's and they haven't got anything? Will we go to another supermarket and the choice just isn't as good so I'll go back to Aldi and they haven't got it? Honestly, I feel like I'm I'm on too much of a roll here, I feel like I just need to go buy everything vegan out there. <laughs> so anyway, I thought I'd just show you a few things that I've got. Um, There's probably not going to be much order to it, but um, yeah. So these, vegan pan of chalk. And they actually look exactly like normal pan of chocks as well. We are actually trying to be good, but I thought as a little treat, maybe like weekend for breakfast. Got to give them a try for you guys, obviously. Any excuse? And then we absolutely love brioche buns. And Audi do vegan brioche buns, which just like the pan of chalk, look exactly like normal ones. Can't wait to give them a try. We have had some vegan ones before when we've had a Gusto delivery. And they were really good. You literally couldn't tell the difference. So, happy with these finds. Oh, and then, as you'll see from the clips previous, it was just everywhere. There was just stuff everywhere. Anything that said vegan, I was like, oh, try that. Oh, I was like, oh, do I need it? Oh, whatever, I'll get it. So, next up. Caramelised biscuit cupcake and chocolate cupcakes. So I've seen on Instagram that these are kind of like a Biscoff dupe and I absolutely love any some Biscoff. Jade doesn't like Biscoff. So obviously I had to get her the chocolate ones because she'd be absolutely fuming if I brought myself some and not her. So I've got these. Next up, this Energy Vita nutritional yeast flakes. Now this is like a vegan cupboard staple, I believe. It's like a cheesy nutty flavour flakes that just like add like extra flavour to things. Um, people use it instead of like cheese. So I thought I'd get that. I don't know what we're going to actually use it for yet. But I thought, give that a try. Next up. Ugh. these soy yogurts. I've got a jade blueberry flavour and I got myself the vanilla flavour. See what they're like, have that with some fruit in the morning. Next up, I saw these ready meals. 
um, which I thought would be really good to take to work. Um, and I like the fact that they're all in like plastic tubs that I could reuse again, so I don't have to throw them away. So I like that. These are like a cool, nice round shape as well. So the first one I got was a katsu inspired bowl. That looks really good. Just can't wait to give that a try. The next one was a Mediterranean inspired bowl. And then I got a 3 bean chili and a coronation chickpea curry. So yeah, these are really good. They're good for that on the go, or like I say, at work if you fancy something a little bit more substantial. Next up, I just saw this vegan chocolate. <clears throat> So I've got a vegan classic, whatever classic is, don't know. And then I've got a vegan blonde, which I'm not actually sure what that is. I'm, I'm thinking it could potentially be like a white chocolate bar. I thought either way, I'll give it a try. Next up, cookies. So I've got vegan fruit flapjack cookies and double chocolate chip cookies. Love a good cookie in this house. Could not pick them up. Jade will probably love me for buying these. Next up, some veggie dippers. They are red peppers, arborio rice, garlic and onions coated in a crunchy golden crumb. So I bought these just to keep in, probably put them in the freezer if we ever have a night where we don't have anything planned. Same for this, I thought we could just put this in the freezer for like a quick bolognese or something. So I just brought some meat-free mints. Next up, these no sausage rolls. I've tried the, is it Linda McCartney ones or? They're really good. So if they're anything like these, then they should be really nice. And then some no chicken burgers. Probably probably gonna be quite similar to the ones I brought from Sainsbury's the other day. But I thought vegan brioche buns, chicken burgers. And then what else do you need with chicken burgers? Some peri peri mayo. Neither of us a massive mayo fan, so I thought I'd get one that's got a bit of a flavour to it, so it's not just the pure mayo taste. So I'm looking forward to trying this. I assume it's probably like a Nando's dupe version. And then, last but not least, these chocolate melt in the middle puddings. These look so good, however forgot to buy any ice cream or cream. I looked for cream, they didn't have any vegan cream. Forgot to look for ice cream, so. Don't know what we're gonna have with them, but I thought, can't not get them. They've got quite a long day on, so I've got a while yet to find some alternative to go with that. That's pretty much everything I brought that's, ne that's necessarily branded vegan. And then I just brought some, some nuts to snack on. And then some dried mango. And I absolutely love dried mango. So I've got that just to snack on as well. And then an actual mango and some melon. Jade loves the melon, I love the mango. So yeah, as you can see, once again, I mean, I'm probably gonna get told off for going a bit overboard here, but like I say, that was just so much. I just couldn't help myself. So yeah, I'm sorry if that was a bit long and boring, but as you can see, I was just a bit excited. <laughs> the fridge, once again, is literally ready to bust. Anyone would think there's a family of five living in this house. Nope, just us two. And same for the cupboard. 
below my neck. Someone stop me going shopping, please, I beg you. Thanks for watching my little Audi haul. I hope it wasn't too long and boring for you. Um, hopefully I've given you some inspiration if you didn't have any. But I definitely recommend going to check that out. Um, everything was really well priced. And pretty well stocked as well. So yeah, go check that out. Thank you for watching. Bye!